What's going on everybody? I'm back with another High Limit Coin Buster video for you all today. In today's video we're going to be doing a $1 million buy-in. And they gave us 100 quarters to get started today. Extremely expensive game, so uh, wish me the best of luck. Hopefully we can walk out of here with millions of dollars. My goodness, I must say this is one of the best setups I've seen in there in a very long time. They got... Uh, Probably the world's biggest poker chip tower back there on the pusher. It's entirely made out of uh, $1,000 chips. And I got some uh, $20 bills on the play field. I think we got a $10 bill out of there. There was one $10 bill. And they got like uh, two ginormous towers made out of $5,000 chips and $10,000 chips. And there's a whole bunch of golden towers in there. And there is uh, eight of the white dice visible in there. There's one white dice on top of each one of them towers. So them white dice, if we can win those, we'll get to roll them at the very end of this game, whatever they land on. My uh, winnings will multiply by those numbers. So anyhow, that was the last of our quarters. Now let's go see what we've won. We'll get right back to pushing. Oh yeah, jackpot baby, check this out. We got a handful of cash in all these quarters right here. I'd say we probably got around, uh, oh gosh, three or 400 quarters. So let's keep it pushing across the whole field and try to get this ginormous poker chip power to get going. Yeah, honestly, that thing might uh, shatter the entire uh, glass wall right here whenever it falls down. That would be absolutely insane. Well, I don't think I would get in trouble for that. The employees would be the ones that would get in trouble. Because uh, they're the ones who built the tower this massive. I don't think there's ever been a tower that tall in there before. So anyway, we definitely have the potential to make a lot of money today. But we are going to have to win some uh, poker chips out of there in order to win anything close to a million dollars back. So might be a pretty difficult road ahead of us, but I think we're going to get it. Oh my goodness. Wow, check that out. That right there is a good indication that it's getting close to crashing down lost like four uh, the $1,000 chips at the base of it. It's an awesome sign right there. It's Like I said, it's about to go, I think. Let's see if we can get it to go before we run out of quarters. Oh, nice. There it goes. A couple more uh, chips fell out of the base of it there. Come on, nice push. Give me something. All right, so we're down to about uh, 20, 30 quarters. Let's get them in there and see what it does. Oh my gosh. So uh, be keeping a close eye on that tower. It might decide to fall down while I'm down there uh, retrieving the quarters. So let's do that real quick and we'll get right back to pushing. All righty, we're back. Let's keep it pushing. So we're up to about uh, 800 quarters now. We still need to try to win as many quarters back as possible because that's not going to be enough to get it all cleared out of there today. My goodness, this John Lormus Tower, it is so close to going. So uh, let me know down in the comments how much money you think that massive tower is. All those thousand dollar chips right there. Oh my goodness, do you see that? Holy moly, there was a brown mystery bag hidden inside of that tower. Oh my goodness, it's going to go. I really, really think it is. It's teetering back and forth at this point. About to get some $1,000 chips in the center. Nice, there we go. That's our first like little bit of real money that we've made. Or big money. Oh my goodness. Wow, that was incredible. That couldn't have failed any better. Yeah, I thought for sure that that tower was going to get stuck against the glass. I was 99.9% .9 sure of it. And we got that brown mystery bag also. Oh my goodness, wow. This is doing absolutely exceptional. Oh no, well I can see behind this tower right here, the dice that was on top of this one. Oh no, it's about to fall down the gutter. Well, I hope that does not happen because if it falls down the gutter, it would go to the owner. For the ones who don't know, there's like uh, two little side spaces on the left and the right hand side. You can't see them at the moment because the great big old towers are uh, blocking the view and stuff. 
But uh, anything that goes down through there goes to the owner. And we're about to lose the DOS. Yeah, it's gone now. I don't see it over there. But it, hopefully we can at least get that one right there behind the tower. Pretty sure y'all can see that anyway. Oh yeah, it's pushing real good. Bunch of thousand dollar chips just fail. Oh my gosh, this tower right here is getting super close also. About to make a uh, boatload of money. That's guaranteed. So I'm not quite sure if all those thousand dollar chips totaled up to a million dollars. But uh, it's pretty close to it, I'd say. So we're pretty close to breaking even right now. Yeah, like I said, I don't think I've ever seen a poker chip tower that massive before. That was incredible. Definitely one of the best tower builds I've seen before. Yeah, I'll probably give the staff like a uh, $5,000 chip or something. Just for uh, making the tower that massive. And it'll be a super, super entertaining video for you all in the process. So, I guess it's a win-win every way you look at it, right? Now this tower is super close to the edge. I don't know how it's still hanging on there. We're about to get that DOS right there also any second now. Yeah, the DOS are definitely the most valuable things in the game. Because uh, they can turn like uh, one million chips. Or let's just say we've won a million dollars in chips. That DOS right there, nice, we just got it. That would have the potential to turn one million into six million. Because if it landed on a six, the six is the highest number it could go. You can multiply one million by a six. That'd be a six million dollar win right there. So uh, then if it landed on a two, it'd be a two million dollar win. You get what I'm saying. And uh, say we get two of the white dice out of there and we won uh, 10 million in chips by the end of this game. Uh, say the white dice total up to 10, 10 times 10 million in chips. It means we'd have a hundred million dollar win off of this game right here. So we definitely have the potential to win a lot. There's also two mystery bags. I know you probably can't see them. You might can see them in the uh, reflection back there if you look closely. However, there is a uh, purple mystery bag behind these towers on the left blue shelf. And a like dark gray mystery bag on the right. Don't think I've seen a gray mystery bag in there before. Well, actually, I think I have. It's been months ago, though. So I'm just glad they're starting to uh, bring back some of the older stuff. Or some new stuff, matter of fact. Because it gets a little boring seeing the same stuff over and over and over again. You know what I'm saying? At least they started uh, adding a bunch of brand new stuff in there. Bunch of prizes. That would be a better uh, word to use for that, so... Anyway, let's see, we're almost out of quarters. I've just been getting quarters out of the loot shoot to keep the game going. I will uh, separate all those thousand dollar chips and all the chips that we've won for that matter. Yeah, we might as well go ahead and just call it quits right there. Let's go round up the quarters right quick and we'll continue pushing for a little while to try to get these great big old towers. So we'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. So before we get back to pushing, I would like to go ahead and open up this uh, brown mystery bag right here. Feels like it's loaded up pretty good. Kind of feels like there's a whole bunch of chips in there of some sort. So let's see what we've won. Oh my goodness, wow, check this out. We got the $5 chip and it looks like five of the $1 chips. We also got the $10 chip today. So this $10 chip, this is worth one or more free bonus towers. I get to turn this in, they'll let me spin a wheel and the wheel has all these different types of chip values on there. And uh, whatever it lands on, that's what type of brand new tower or towers they'll build in the play field. So that is incredible. And uh, each one of these $1 chips is worth 500 free quarters. So this right here is 2,500 free quarters. That is absolutely marvelous right there. And uh, this $5 chip right here, we'll get to turn this in. They'll take all the stuff that is on the blue shelves and uh, they'll put it back into the playing field. That is absolutely marvelous right there. Uh, that Mr. Bag was loaded up brilliantly well. So anyway, let's get right back to pushing. Let's try to load up the quarters really really high back there on the pusher to try to get a large base of quarters built up behind all these ginormous towers i was uh putting a couple dollars in there at the time it would take a long time to get these ginormous towers to get going so uh let's rapid fire like all these quarters right here 
in there at one time. Are you ready? All right, let's see what that does right there. Hopefully that gives us a nice push. Oh yeah, this tower right here just moved. That is a tremendous amount of money right there. Yeah, all those uh, pink chips right there, pinkish purple chips, those are uh, $5,000 chips. And the orange chips up top, those are made out of uh, $10,000 chips. So, uh, yeah, there's definitely quite a bit of money in there. Let's rapid fire a bunch more, see what happens. Let's see what that does right there. Hopefully we can get a nice push. Oh yeah, that tower on the right, it's going to go any second now. Oh my goodness, wow. Nice, there it goes. Wow, that was absolutely exceptional. Alright, so I think we need to push on the left now. Try to get that other ginormous tower, $5,000 chips to go. Well, now you can see the uh, blue shelves a lot better. Thank goodness we got that $5 chip today. Yeah, if we would not have won that $5 chip, we'd have had to pay uh, two times the original buy-in to get them to put all that stuff that is on the blue shelves into the playing field. So, yeah, that saved us from having to pay uh, $2 million today. It would have been a $3 million buy-in in total. I did a $1 million buy-in to get the 100 quarters to start off with, and then uh, I'd have to pay another $2 million to get the blue shelf. So that'd be a $3 million buy-in in total if that $5 chip was not in there. So thank goodness we got it. And we also got all those $1 chips. So we could really, really use all those extra quarters today. Because, matter of fact, there was no quarter towers in there at all today. There was not even any quarter pyramids. It was all just like a bunch of quarters just uh, scattered across the machine. So, But I guess we're doing pretty good. There must have been a bunch of quarters like hidden inside that great big old poker chip tower because I don't remember seeing all those quarters in there. Oh yeah, if we could just get this tower right here, we'll be set. Alright, let's rapid fire a bunch more quarters in there, shall we? There we go. That was the whole entire basket of quarters. We need a lot of uh, quarters to push on the left-hand side. Nice. There we go. That was a wonderful push right there, over there on the right side anyway. This is doing remarkably well today, though. Yeah, what do y'all think about that uh, John Lummis tower that was on the pusher back there at the beginning of the game? Has to be pretty close to the world's biggest tower, poker chip tower anyway. Oh yeah, that one on the left, it's going. Look at that, any second now. Oh my gosh, nice, there it goes, it got stuck. Oh yeah, jackpot baby. Wow. Oh my goodness. Holy macaroni, this is doing phenomenal today. So uh, hit that thumbs up button if you're enjoying this video so far. If you want to see more videos like this one seven days a week, uh, be sure you're subscribed to the channel and have the notification bell enabled. That way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video. Would help out tremendously. We're on the road to 150,000 subscribers. My goal is to get there. Well, actually, I don't have a goal to get to 150,000 subscribers anymore. But one of my goals is to get to at least 200,000 subscribers by the end of this year. By the end of 2024... I want to have uh, 200,000 subscribers, so uh, if you all can make that happen for me, that would be amazing. 
There would be lots of large buy-in videos. And uh, each one of y'all who hit the subscribe button help out much more than you know, or much more than you think. Because uh, one person subscribes and then ten more people subscribe. I mean, each subscriber adds up, so every single person makes a difference. So anyway, at this point, I'm just trying to win these quarters back before we turn in the $10 chip. Yeah, let's turn in the $10 chip first. That way, if we lose any of the stuff that they put in there, if it falls over on the blue shelf, we'll automatically put it back into the playing field whenever I uh, turn in that $5 chip. Sounds like a pretty good plan. All right, so let's see. Hopefully we can at least get that gold bar. Might get another push on the right. Nice, there we go, we got the gold bar. It would take a long time to get this tower over here though. So uh, anyway, let's go ahead and turn in that uh, $10 chip and all five of the $1 chips and we'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $10 chip and all five of them $1 chips. They gave me 2,500 more quarters. And I got to spin that wheel and today it landed on one ounce gold bars. As you can see, they built like uh, one enormous like wall of gold right here in the center and they built like two smaller towers of gold on the uh, pusher back there so yeah wish me good luck hopefully we can get all this gold cleared out of here and uh, I'll turn in that five dollar chip here in a few minutes after we get all this gold out of here and uh, that tower that was over here on the left it's still standing there they did not rearrange that unfortunately Really, really hoping they'll do something about that tower whenever I turn in the $5 chip. Nice, there we go. We got a tremendous amount of gold right there. Let's uh, go ahead and stack this thing up using the skill stop. Try to get a massive base of quarters built up behind all this gold. It'll really, really speed up the process of winning it all out of there. If you've been keeping up with the videos, you'll know the skill stop technique is very, very effective. Oh my goodness, wow, it all got jammed up in the loot chute. Holy moly, let's get it all cleared out of there. Alrighty, I'm back. So it took me about probably five or six minutes to get all that gold out of there. I was being very, very stubborn. Oh no, well, I accidentally threw a $10,000 chip back in there, so... Uh, more than likely they would give me a refund for that whenever I call them back here to turn in that $5 chip they'll just get that out of there and give me that $10,000 back so uh, anyway yeah like I said it took me about six minutes five or six minutes to uh, get all that gold out of the payout shoe but that doesn't compare to how long it took me to separate all those thousand dollar chips that we won whenever that uh, world's biggest tower fell over. It took me about uh, 45 minutes to go through all that stuff. Separate it and see if you don't know this, uh, the staff actually want me to put like the chips into this great big old box and there's different sections to the box. I have to put the $5,000 chips in one section and then the uh, $10,000 chips in the other, the gold bars in one and all that good stuff. So uh, yeah, it usually takes a long time to separate all that stuff. But uh, anyway, we got that 10 grand to fall down to the lower shelf. We might as well win it back out of there. Why not? Now, this has definitely been a magnificent game today so far. So uh, comment the number uh, four if you've made it this far into the video. Comment the number four. I'm only going to say that once. Because I know a lot of people are going to be skipping through the videos and stuff. Oh my goodness, well I accidentally almost put a $5,000 chip back in there. That wouldn't have been good. Especially after about to win the $10,000 chip that we accidentally put back in there. Alright, there we go. So I'm going to go ahead and turn in that $5 chip and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I turned in that $5 chip, and they took all the towers that was on the blue shelves, and they put them all into the playing field. Oh my goodness. Well, we almost were in trouble right there. We almost lost that uh, white dice to the blue shelf. 
And if we lose anything at all to the blue shelves on this round right here, if there's no more special chips in there, then it would not uh, come with a free reset. So for example, if we end up losing something, which we did lose the dice over there, so I'm definitely going to pay an extra $100,000 to have them put all that back into the play field. Well, that's if there's no uh, special chips in those Mr. Bags right there. Now, there could be a 5,000 slash 10,000 chip, a $50 chip, I mean, maybe another $10 chip, you never know. Or it could be a dark blue earbud that gets, that gets us a, a cash-only bonus game, you never know. So, uh, yeah, this is doing remarkably well so far. Oh my gosh, nice, there we go. We got the massive tower of $5,000 chips. I think we got one of them uh, white dice also. So there's a white dice right there. It's in a pretty good spot. It's like technically in the center. There's also another one back there on the pusher. Do you see that? Oh my goodness, nice. There it goes. And there's uh, one more white dice on top of this uh, gold right here. So hopefully we can get all this stuff to go. So anyway, I would like to take a uh, moment to uh, appreciate all the new subscribers and all the support recently. You all are truly amazing. I appreciate your all's support. Yeah, we couldn't have got this far without each and every one of y'all supporting the channel, watching the videos, subscribing, hitting that like button. I appreciate each and every one of you all. You all are truly amazing. And I really, really enjoy making these videos for you all. I've been doing this consistently for about uh, three and a half, four years now. Ever since like the summer of 2020, I've been doing this. Oh nice, we just got another white dice right there. That is excellent. Absolutely excellent. We're also about to get this tower right here. So uh, anyway, yeah, I've been uploading every day pretty much consistently for two years now. But uh, back when I first started making these videos, I had a lot of stuff going on back then. I was still in school. And uh, I barely had time to uh, stop by here and play this game. But uh, I'm out of school now. Let's just say that. I don't want to uh, give away too much personal information. But uh, let's just say I'm out of school now. So I have as much time as I need to uh, make these videos for you all. So... Oh my goodness, wow, that was incredible. Holy guacamole, that was all $10,000 chips, I'm pretty sure. Nice, we're going to be rich today. Or tonight, as I should say. It's actually not time as I'm filming this. Uh, this video is being filmed on a totally different day than you're going to see it on YouTube. I've actually probably about uh, three videos ahead right now, three or four videos ahead. I have videos just lined up and ready to go. And uh, let me know if you like the brand new upload schedule. I've been uploading around uh, anywhere from 2.30 to 4 o'clock uh, Eastern Standard Time in the day. So let me know if I should uh, continue with that upload schedule. I feel like uh, the videos have been doing a lot better. The performance has been better. Getting a lot more views. All that good stuff. So, uh... Anyway, I think we should go ahead and call them back here and pay that extra $100,000. Have them put that back into the playing field. But first, let's check out the two mystery bags just to be 100% sure that there's no more uh, special chips in there. So let's get the mystery bags out of the loot chute and we'll open them up. All right, so here's those two mystery bags. I think I'm going to go ahead and open up the gray mystery bag first just because I haven't seen one of these in here in a couple months, like I said. So hopefully it's loaded up super good. Oh my goodness, wow, there was three of the white dice in there. Oh my goodness, that is absolutely remarkable. Yeah, this is definitely going to be a humongous win today, especially from a $1 million buy-in. And you want to know the crazy thing? I actually did a $100 million buy-in the other day. Well, it was technically a $300 because I had to buy in three times to get it to go. And uh, there was only seven white dice in a $300 million buy-in game. We barely even made our money back. 
So anyway, oh my goodness, we got two of the golden dice and a silver dice. So the gold dice, those will multiply our gold by whatever they land on. And the silver dice, that will multiply our quarters. So that is not bad, not bad at all. That Mr. Bag was loaded up super good. So I'm going to go ahead and pay that extra 100 grand. Have them uh, put all that back into the play field and we'll be right back. Alrighty, we're back. Let's get right back to pushing. So I called them back here and I paid that extra $100,000 and they took all that gold that we lost, including that dice that we lost, they put that back into the playing field. Matter of fact, they just took all the gold that was in there. I think there was some over here on this left side. They built it into a brand new, like, small golden tower on the pusher. They put the dice on top of that. So hopefully we can get all this stuff out of here. Oh, nice. That dice is definitely in a safe place now. Oh yeah, we're going to get that out of there pretty easily, I guess. Oh yeah, it's on the edge. That push right there is going to get it. Oh my goodness, it's literally defying gravity. That one quarter is the only thing holding it up. Nice, there we go, we got it. That is amazing. Yeah, I can't get over how good this is pushing today. We're going to make so much money, especially from a $1 million buy-in. I'm surprised they wasn't uh, charging more for us to play this game. This game should have been like at least a $10 million buy-in in my opinion, but I'm not complaining whatsoever. Won all this stuff out of here for $1 million? That is absolutely outrageous. It's definitely been a marvelous game today though. And if you've enjoyed the video, hit that like button try to get to at least uh, 10,000 likes on this video today. 10,000 likes. I know we can get there. Just need y'all watching to uh, hit that thumbs up button. So anyhow, we got the whole entire machine cleared out today. That is absolutely exceptional. This has been a miraculous game today. Absolutely miraculous. So now I'm going to go ahead and call them back here. I think we have won 13 dice in total. We got uh, 10 of the white dice and uh, 2 of the gold dice and 1 silver dice. They'll put all 13 of them dice on the pusher. And we have to roll them on out to this lower play field. Whatever they all land on, we're going to get to multiply our winnings in our gold and our quarters by those numbers. So uh, let's call them back here and we'll get right back to pushing. Alrighty, we're back. So let's keep on pushing. Now this right here is definitely the most exciting part of the game and definitely the most intense part of the game because uh, these dice right here determine how big of a profit we're going to make and a lot of times considering how big the buy-in is uh, the dice determine whether or not you're going to even break even so anyway we got a four and a one so far let's see if we can't flip that one over to something else oh my goodness they're doing amazing holy mackerel so it uh, looks like uh, three of the dice landed on one so far. Well, let's see. Four of them in total landed on one. So the ones were not counted all, so just pretend those ones don't exist. However, the rest of them did absolutely remarkable. So anyway, I'm going to count everything up, multiply our winnings and our gold by all that, and I'll let y'all know how much money we have made today from a $1.1 million buy-in. We'll be right back. You all are not going to believe how much money I have won today. This is absolutely insane. I ended up winning $7,029,110. That is the chips and all that cash put together. And the white dice totaled up to 30, so I'm going to get to multiply my winnings by 30. And in total, I ended up winning $210,873,300 from a $1.1 million buy-in. Oh my goodness, I'm literally shaking right now. This is absolutely insane. I was not expecting to make anywhere near that amount of money today especially considering the buy-in was only a million dollars. Oh my goodness, we hit the mega jackpot on this game today, baby. That is just incredible, absolutely exceptional game today indeed. So anyhow, moving on, we also won 177 ounces of gold, and the gold I started up to 11, so I'm going to get to multiply the gold by 11. And in total, I ended up winning 1,947 ounces of gold today. So uh, the spot price of gold is like 2,040 an ounce, I think. 
So that means we got an extra $3,971,880 in gold. So that right there is almost uh, four times our buy-in just in gold bars alone. That is insane. That is an outrageous win for the gold today also. And uh, last but not least, we ended up winning, I believe it was uh, 3,459 quarters. And that silver dice landed on a one, unfortunately, so we're not going to get to multiply our quarters by anything. But still, let's divide that by four. That means we got uh, $864.75 in quarters. That's not bad, not bad at all. So that is an extremely good win for a uh, $1.1 million buy-in. So if y'all enjoyed this video and you want to see more videos like this one, uh, be sure you hit that uh, thumbs up button, hit that subscribe button, and turn on the post bell notifications. That way you get notified for whenever I post a brand new video. So if you want to check out a whole entire playlist of my videos, that will appear at the bottom right of the screen. And if you want to check out uh, my previous video, yesterday's video, uh, that will appear at the bottom left of the screen. And if you want to check out one of Coin Pusher's videos, I highly suggest you would. That will appear at the top left of the screen. And uh, lastly, if you want to subscribe to my channel and check out some of my other videos, you can click that button at the top right of the screen. So with all that being said, I will see everybody on the next episode. Y'all take care and have an outstanding day.